Growing up, I went to a lot of concerts. And I'd always see these big bands at these big arenas and everyone uniting together just to celebrate music. And I always thought that was incredible. Usually people don't really realize what they want to do. But from India, like 10 years old, I was like, nope, this is what I'm doing. I don't care what any of you guys say. There's nothing stopping me. I've always wanted to be that person on stage, getting everyone together. Putting smiles on everyone's faces. Growing up in California has been pretty incredible. It's awesome living in Orange County. I don't know, it's wild. It's really shaped me into the person I am today and I'm very blessed to live here. I'm 100% proud to be a Californian boy. My childhood was really fun. I can't think of a time where I was never not doing something. I grew up playing baseball, but I grew up going to the beach a lot. I never surfed though. All of my friends surf. I don't surf or skate, it's weird. I live in California and I don't do two of those things, but I play guitar, so I guess that's like, it's all right. So growing up, I was always singing, always singing in the car. My brother would always punch me and say, stop singing. But I'm like, I can't, it just happens. But I never acted on it. And my sister, she did a play when she was about 12. And I saw her on stage and I was like, hey mom, like, I can do that. So I did my first play and I absolutely fell in love with music and dancing. And I never wanted to stop, so I haven't. <laughs> So when I first walked out on stage for the first time, I was very scared. Like my stomach was turning. So much was going on through my brain. Those pretty faces always make you stand out in a crowd. I would get really nervous before a show, and once I stepped on stage, all those feelings would just go away, and I'd have so much fun performing. It's like I broke a barrier. Plants prosper and not to harm you. So I've also been acting since I was like 10 years old. TV shows, commercials, and movies. I know you don't like people just because of the way they look, Daddy. That they ain't right. That's what kids do to me at school. And one thing I've learned from that is don't be afraid of the word no, because you're going to hear it a lot and no matter what you do. So uh, yeah, just always keep your head up and keep plowing through life. So I kind of see myself as an all-around entertainer. Because I'm an actor. I play guitar, I play drums, I play bass, I play piano. I sing, I dance. To be 100% honest with you, when Simon called my name, now. all these emotions were coming over me and I, I didn't really know how I felt. I was like, oh my God, like I, they picked me, but I was also like really sad too because Josh was like my best friend throughout the week. He didn't get picked and I was like, oh my God, like I'm so sorry. But yet I was so excited for myself. Oh, it was just such an intense feeling. And then when he called Josh, that's when I really like lost it. That's when I started crying and stuff. I feel like I could fall to the floor. It's now United. I'm insanely proud of myself. Let's get it started. Let's go! Ever since I was 10, I was like, no, this is what I want to do for, for the rest of my life. So I'm going to work. I'm going to work on bettering myself. So I'm really excited about this project because I think it's going to make this world a better place. I think it'd make a huge impact on the world if everyone really understood what it's like to be from all these different countries. Because from boot camp and learning just a little bit about their cultures and where they're from has changed my view just on life. And also, I just want to tell everyone that anyone from anywhere can do anything.